Bay begins uh, for Saturday's launch at 2 p.m. Central Time. S 124 with its international crew of seven astronauts will bring. We'll take questions from the panel after we hear from our, our representatives. Charlie? Uh, all of our systems are in good shape. Our countdown work is on schedule and we have no issues to report. Uh, it will be a beautiful sight as Discovery roars to life on Saturday afternoon, carrying with her the largest pressurized module ever delivered to the ISS. Thank you. Ohio Gazimas. Good morning, everyone. Uh, it's a real pleasure to be here today to tell you that the Kibo pressurized module is closed out and ready for launch within Discovery's payload bay. We have no further work uh, planned for that element prior to launch, and the PM is quite content to sit in the payload bay as long as is necessary to get it off the ground, so we have no scrub turnaround constraints associated with our primary element on this mission. As with every flight, we try to maximize the amount of material that we can carry up. Some of that's limited by the shuttle's performance just from a lifting capacity, but some of it's limited by our center of gravity requirements for the orbiter. And of course, we have a very large module, and, um, and so it is influencing the orbiter C CG significantly. And so we have maximized the amount of cargo that we can carry up in the mid-deck based on the mass properties of the PM. Arrive with the um, toilet pump and how big of a piece of hardware is it? The hardware is it's being hand carried from Russia and, and the individual bringing it should be arriving in Orlando around 8.30 or so tonight and then give them an hour and a half or so to get over here so we expect it to be on dock about 10 p.m. The hardware in total weighs about 35 pounds. The pump itself is about 29 pounds. Service module toilet working at all up there, or are they simply using the Soyuz toilet, or what's the details that you're aware of? Well, what I saw in the status from overnight was that it was still working sporadically, but uh, we'd have to ask the ops guys as to whether it's actually working at this moment. Good morning, and um, is it actually a Russian space official who's hand-carrying it over? 